Welcome to the Nono Giorgio and Rory Cooking Italian for Weight Loss channel. We have entrees, desserts, tips and tricks. We welcome you to our channel. We hope you make some of these recipes, enjoy them with your friends and family. Please like our video by checking the little thumbs up that way you let us know you enjoyed it. Please subscribe by hitting the subscribe button, then the bell and all. This will ensure that you get all of our new videos. Our cookbooks are available from both Amazon and Apple, ebooks, iBooks, and paperback versions. This is a delicious, nutritious, super salad. Here you can see all the ingredients in the salad and then individually dished into serving dishes. Hi! Hi! Welcome back to the Nono Giorgio and Rory <laughs> Cooking Italian channel. And today we're going to do a super salad. salad. Salads range from, you know, Iceberg the worst, lettuce. which is iceberg <laughs> lettuce, because it has no nutrient value, just a lot of water, uh, and people put, you know, fatty salad dressing on it. Yeah. Up through simple salads where you may have a, a green and a tomato, or a little onion, up to super salads where you have things that are crunchy and delicious and it has different flavors. Yeah. And we're gonna do our salad with uh, extra virgin olive oil, uh, balsamic demodena, salt and pepper. So tell them uh, the demodena thing, because I didn't know that. Uh, balsamic demodena is, is a town, Modena is a town in Italy and they're yeah. known for their balsamic vinegar. Um, it's a brown vinegar, yeah. it, and if you've been using uh, wine vinegar or something like totally that, different. totally different. This has got a wonderful, wonderful flavor. And it's a little sweet. And it's a little, little on the sweet yeah. side. Yeah, heavy sweet. But it's a, it's a nice mixture with yeah. a little bit of that and a little bit of, of olive oil. Yeah. And, and lemon juice too. And Sorry. lemon. And, and we're going to put some lemon juice. In with the with dressing. It. But we'll show you, George will show you his fabulous dressing. And what I'm going to do is, is bring the camera over so you can see these things and Rory can tell you what each one is. Okay, Chef Rory. Yes, okay, so I woke up so excited this morning because we just signed up for a vegetable delivery service. And I'm not going to tell you which one it is until we, real, we see that it's very good. But so far we're happy with the first but they sent us all these wonderful vegetables. So we have leaf lettuce, uh, we have arugula, which George is gonna tell you more about. One thing about lettuce is don't dry it out completely when you wash it. Like this had to be washed pretty thoroughly because it had dirt on it. You know, these are um, uh, organic vegetables right out of the farms that we order. So. Clean it really well, but then leave a little water on it to dilute the dressing because um, it, it, it gives it a little more flavor. And then we got green peppers. Uh, we got one beet, uh, some of these Roma tomatoes, and here's our avocado. Um, and the stones in there. Yep. <laughs> that keeps the avocado from turning brown. Yeah. A little trick. Yeah, that and also if you put it just a, a few drops of lemon juice in it, it helps. Um, olives and um, shallots. I always get those two names mixed up, but these are shallots. They're the little ones that a little purple skin on them. Um, and uh, we just made some quinoa, which we just made according to the package directions. And you put a little in it? Oh yeah, a little parsley over here. If you haven't watched our shows, we use these wonderful herb scissors to cut herbs with, and uh, they're just a favorite of ours. And um, these are pine nuts. Uh, George is going to roast them a little and make them a little bit brown because it adds to their flavor. As far as uh, pine nuts, they're very expensive. We've seen them beginning at, um, 
what was it like three ounces for eight dollars was yeah. it <laughs> at one store um, and the best place we found to buy them is at Costco where we get a bag of two pounds I think for $25 yeah. so they're expensive nuts but they really heighten the quality of your dishes and they give it that little extra luxury it's good in pasta and it makes the best cookies the pignoli cookies. yeah at Christmas time we made those and the uh, feta cheese so when uh, we were talking about this this morning, George said to me, are you going to put everything in the refrigerator and the salad? And I said, pretty much. <laughs> so that's where we are, guys. And then we have this beautiful wood bowl with uh, the wood utensils. And we're gonna mix our salad up in there and hopefully it won't overflow because there's a lot of stuff. <laughs> and that's why we call it the super salad. <laughs> okay, so one thing about the uh, arugula for those who haven't had it, and in England, it's called uh, rocket. And sometimes <laughs> in Italy, they'll call it rocket because they're closer with the English from England than the English from America. Uh, but it's arugula. It's not a, le a, a lettuce. Um, it's a leafy vegetable, and uh, it's delicious. It's peppery. Um, I first learned to have it in New York City because everyone served uh, arugula in New York. That was your salad. It was just wonderful. And a funny story about it, um, I had a guy, Roger, that used to work for me and we had a company that did consulting and um, um, teaching. And Roger was in um, England teaching a course and when he came back he was all excited like a little kid on Christmas morning. He goes, George, I had this wonderful, wonderful thing. I said, what was it, Roger? <laughs> and he said, it was arugula. He said, it's the best thing ever. <laughs> I said, Roger, that grows as a weed around New York City. <laughs> and here's the arugula, so you get a good look at it. It's, uh, it's a cousin to um, mustard greens, uh, just to give you a little context. So... Okay. All right, so we got the pine nuts. I put a little olive oil and I wiped it with a paper towel so it's not, you know, super oily. And I put the pine nuts in and it's on like a medium heat. And we're just going to toast them and toss them a little bit. And then we're going to put them in a, in a little container and we'll, we'll sprinkle them on the salad at the end. They'll be cool by then. Okay. Sounds delicious. Okay, so we're gonna take the arugula or the rocket for you <laughs> Brits. And we're gonna take the lettuce. We'll put our greens at the bottom when we first build this. And then you, it doesn't matter. I'm gonna put the quinoa and just mix it around. We're going to toss this. So George told me, I love quinoa, uh, George told me that it's classified as an ancient grain. Um, not sure what that means, but it sounds wonderful. <laughs> and then we'll do our olives. <laughs> our shallots. Tomatoes. <laughs> There's so many ingredients in this salad, it's hard to keep it Here's straight. Here's our peppers. <laughs> oh, this is going to be so good. I'm very weird. I'm a person who gets excited about salad, for God's sake. Our <laughs> avocado. And this is, oh, this avocado is so ripe. Perfect. And our beets. Be careful with the beets, uh, red beet juice stains. They're very bright red. And of course you've, you've read, I'm sure, that you're supposed to eat colors, right? That it's, it's good to eat foods of all different colors. I'm mm -hmm. sure you've read that. The darker the color, the better. Yeah, especially as far as greens, right, George? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. And the reds, the dark reds. Yeah. Blues, yeah. like blueberries. Yep. Strawberries. Oh, and there's our roasted pine nuts. 
for an extra elegant touch. Yeah. Okay. Beautiful. So uh, we're gonna take some fresh basil from our plant. And I was told uh, in some of the cooking classes I took in Italy um, that you tear it, you never cut it. Because when you tear it, the oils come out and it's just wonderful. I'm gonna put a little uh, EVOO. And this is the olive oil that's made to be used um, raw. So we don't use that one for cooking. We just use it for salads and dipping and stuff like that. And a little bit of our balsamic, some fresh black pepper, a little bit of salt, bring the flavors out. And then we have a, a lemon squeezer such a mechanical, old-fashioned thing, but it works perfectly. And when you use these, turn them sideways because they tend to yeah. grab a lot of uh, juice. juice. Yeah. And you'll see that you, you get back something that's completely used. And this is nice too because it keeps in the uh, seeds so you don't have to worry about getting lemon seeds in your food, whatever it is you're cooking. All right, and now for the most important part. <laughs> you want to take all this goodness yep. and mix it. And George just has such a touch for uh, salad dressings. I mean, they just turn out so delicious. Don't, don't use those store-bought, you know, bottle dressings. Bottle dressings. There, there's lots of sugar, there's preservatives. Yeah. Um, you know, when you, those of you who have been to Italy, you know, uh, unless you're in a touristy hotel, you're never going to see bottle dressing. You're going to see oil and vinegar, salt and pepper. That's it. And you can do exciting things with your own dressing. You know, you can create, you can add mustard, you can add horseradish, you can add anything you like to make it to your taste. And then I like to take a little piece and try it. Mm. The lemon's perfect, salt and pepper's perfect. Perfect. Oh, huh? Perfect. <laughs> All right. This is going to give us superpowers. That's right. And in this time of COVID, you need your immune system to be built up. This stuff builds your immune system. Eat lots of greens and reds and blues. You know, just help your body as much as you can. Yeah, he is talking foods though, not right. other things. <laughs> <laughs> Crayons, you know, good foods. All right, guys. All right, we're going to be back with the tasting right. and our favorite part of the show. Eating. The tasting. <laughs> and we got our super salad. Um, if, you, if you cut the uh, lettuces, the arugula, um, just into, you know, nice sized pieces, you don't need a knife. You can, you can just eat your salad with a fork. Yeah. And you know what? We eat great big bowls of salad because it doesn't add a whole lot of calories. It fills you up and it tastes so good. So don't skimp on salads. Make yourself a big bowl. Buy those pine nuts. They make the salad. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. Mm -hmm. So good. Mm -hmm. The Italians know what they're doing. <laughs> And although we probably wouldn't find a, a super salad like this in Italy, they, they, they tend to be, you know, one or two things. They don't mix yeah. a lot. Uh, but this is a very, very healthy and tasting salad. It gives you um, uh, different consistencies in your mouth because yeah. you get hard things you're chewing and soft things. When we make salads, a lot of times we'll put carrots and, and celery in it just for the chew. Yeah. You know, it makes it more interesting. Exactly. So our cookbooks are out. Uh, you probably know. 
the ebook and the iBook, the electronic versions, the ebook's available on Amazon, the iBook on Apple Books. Uh, Amazon also has paperbacks. They have the black and white and the color paperback. All of the recipes that we did, uh, the first 40, are in Volume 1. Volume 2 is getting close. It's coming. We're going we're gonna to shoot for 50 in, uh, recipes in Volume 2. Yeah. And uh, if you like this video, hit that like button, please. Also, hit the subscribe button and then press the bell, all. And then you'll be notified about all of our recipes as they come out. In the notes below the YouTube video, there's usually the name of the YouTube video and there's a little down arrow. If you click on that, the notes open up. The recipe's in there. Yeah. You know, some people say, well, we don't have the recipe unless we buy the cookbook. No, no the there. recipes are free. They're all there. Um, they're in the notes. Just look for it. Okay. For now, ciao, ciao and arrivederci. <laughs> Bye. Hope you're having fun. Thanks for watching. We hope you have enjoyed our channel. If you have, please hit the subscribe button below and the bell next to it so you get notified of new videos when they come out.